hello friends in this video i will provide you the solution of nptel course programming data structure and algorithm using python uh, the week 4 contents is available here week 4 quiz i already solved in a different video you can see that video and uh, in this video i will provide you the solution of week 4 programming assignment the week 4 programming assignment is given here. The last date of submission is 24th of August. This is the guideline. In this uh, programming assignment, we have to write a two Python function. The first Python function named as histogram. It takes a, as input a list of integer with repetitions and return a list of pairs as follows. For each number n that appears in L, there should be exactly one pair n, r, where n is the number and r is the repetitions, how many times number of repetition is r. Next, the final list should be sorted in ascending order by r, number of repetitions, <coughs> the number of repetitions for numbers that occur with the same number of repetitions arrange the pairs in ascending order the value of the number so uh, this is the uh, uh, test case or example that histogram that list is given that 11 occurs one time 7 occurs two times 12 occurs two times 14 occurs two times 13 occurs four times this is the uh, instances next function is uh, in this uh, that uh, the college maintains academic information about the students in three separate list the course details course detail it is a list of pairs of form course code course name where both entries are string it, uh, it is a list of tuples that tuple contains the course code and course name course code course name course code and course name next is student detail this is another list list of pairs of form or list of tuples it contains the roll number and name that like this this is the roll number name this is the roll number and name next a list of tuples triples of the form roll number course code and grade where all the entries are string like this roll number course code grade roll number course code grade like this list of tuples so you have uh, in this case we have our task is to write a function transcript it takes three lists that course details student details and grades that takes this three list as an input and produce a consolidated grades for each student each of the input list may have its entries instead in arbitrary order each entry in the written uh, list should be in the tuple form like this that roll number name and uh, the there is a list that contains course code course name grade course code course name grade like this uh, the output uh, list should be organized as follows the tuple should shorten in ascending order by roll number and each student's grade should sorted in ascending order by course code so this is the instance is given here so the first uh, uh, code the first function is sorry like this the first function is histogram function is given here that create a dictionary count uh, empty dictionary that contains the uh, number and their count for num in l for uh, use a loop for each number in a list if number in count dict dictionary if the number is in count dictionary then increase the count by one that count dictionary uh, value by one count dictionary num plus equal to one if the number is not in dictionary then store that count dict as a key num as a equal to one initialize this one then use the sorted function to sort the uh, items and then return a sorted count right okay so this is the simple function that returns the histogram next is the transcript function it takes course details student detail and grades first convert course details to dictionary for faster lookup first 
convert this course details uh, to uh, like uh, as a dictionary use a list comprehension for course in course details store course 0 course 1 ठीक है course 0 or uh, as a uh, item uh, as a key and course 1 as a value so uh, for this each entry it takes it creates a dictionary like course uh, course name and and course code okay next is create a dictionary to hold student grades so we have create a dictionary that is used to hold a student grade so uh, take a loop for each grade in a grades like grade uh, it contains like this this is the grade three that uh, code course code roll number code and grade is here so uh, extract the uh, roll number course and grade from the grade current grade if the roll number is in student grades student grade dictionary then store append the course course dictionary and uh, course and grade else they store a list of tuple list as a tuple in the as a value so this creates a uh, dictionary that holds a student grade next use a, a loop students uh, to sort each student's grade this is the loop that uses the sorted function to sort the uh, based on grades next create a final list that this is the final list it, uh, it, uh, for each is to use a loop for each student student detail and then uh, extract the roll number and name from that and append the final append roll number name and student grades in a final list and then sort the final list like this so this is the solution of the transcript function uh, now uh, click on the compile and run button to test the uh, public test cases so all the public test cases are passed successfully now click on the submit button uh, to check the private test cases if you check private test case all the private test cases passed here uh, please submit it on or before 24th of august 2023 and please subscribe to my channel and like this videos uh, i'll post this uh, solution in my uh, description box so that you can copy and paste it so please subscribe to my channel and like this video so that i can provide you the more solutions thank you